Hello VC, coming at you again with a video where I'm going to give a review, best I can anyway, the best I can review things about my turntable and the vinyl I've been spinning on the turntable. So far, no issues with anything. Uh, some popping and stuff on some of the vinyl, but nothing too irritating that you know doesn't uh take the enjoyment of listening to the music out of it um i'm sure cleaning can <clears throat> can um take care of that issue the omaha introvert who i've talked about sending you some vc lt i uh spun the first side of the record I'm sending you and, you know, same thing, you know, some popping and everything, but I'm sure if you clean it, the issue will be taken care of. Nothing that, um, <clears throat> nothing that will hamper your enjoyment of listening to the record. I hope you do enjoy listening to the record. I'll send that out to you probably Monday or Tuesday of this coming week. So as you probably have, have it by the end of next week. And, um. You gave me a P.O. box. Hopefully that will be big enough for the record to fit in. Uh, but anyway, that's coming to you. Um, like I said, I hope you enjoy it. Um, I was really interested in spinning my Striper to Hell with the Devil. Vinyl, I've, I've actually spun both sides of that one now. And, you know, hope and hoping that... There are no issues as far as skipping or anything on that one, and there wasn't because I paid a pretty penny for that just to have the band cover art. But um, so far, my first experience listening to records in, oh gosh, 30 plus years has been a great walk down memory lane again and looking forward to some of the vinyl that I've, have on order coming in. Um, glad to be a real vinyl person now, you know, since I'm in the vinyl community, but you know, it's more about the music than the format. So people that just play CDs and things like that, like Dude 1973, hey, love your channels too. Dude 1973, Dan Powers, shouts out to you. Um, but anyway, just wanted to give, give you some of my thoughts on the turntable, the Stratton 850, I think I said it was. Um, also I want to give a shout out to Record Head in West Dallas, Wisconsin here. Um, the original turntable I was going to buy was defective when we tried it out in the store and the man and the man helping me gave me a more expensive turntable at that price of the other one and this one was about 10 15 dollars more so record head you know anybody in wisconsin looking for equipment vinyl give them a check i think peaches says he's he's been there but anyway i'm gonna get out of here have a nice weekend vc rock on god bless